So about four months ago, I graduated college, and ever since then, I felt a little bit lost. So I decided that to start this new stage off on the right track, I was going to create my dream Pinterest room. Honestly, I'm so excited for this video. It's a little bit silly. We are finally, finally doing my extreme room makeover. I've been planning this in my head. I've made mood boards. I have a stack of boxes of things to put in this room. You guys know if you've been following me at all that I've had an interesting past few months. I'm experiencing post-grad and I don't really know what I'm doing with my life. I'm living with my parents. They have a two bedroom apartment. This was my brother's room, but he just moved into college yesterday. So I get to take it over and make it my own. And this is like the most intense room makeover I've ever done. We're starting from basically nothing. So it's almost like a move in video slash room makeover. I have been living on the couch for about two months. So I'm so excited to have this room. I feel so lucky and it's so nice that my parents are letting me live with them let's freaking do this i just had a monster energy for the first time and i'm trying to think that was a bad idea as with any room makeover i need to show you guys kind of what we are starting with so basically a clean slate which is so amazing and this room is gigantic it's kind of ridiculous so here is a little preview of before how the room is looking so you guys can really get a sense of everything that we're going to change in here and of course i had to make this mood board so this is the vibe that we're going for there's some things i really want to include like a reading corner a projector a little work from home area slash like desk workspace and lots of posters because a lot of like my inspiration pictures really had a lot of those elements so that's what we got going on let's do this first thing that i want to do is the bed back here i did sleep in here for the first time last night i just like laid on the plain mattress and it was very comfy but i think we need like actual blankets and stuff i got all the bedding down i've been storing everything that i had in my dorm in my closet so this is all my bedding material we have the duvet cover which i absolutely love it's like one of my favorite amazon finds sheets are also literally my favorite they are pink gingham and one of my other favorite there could be a place for you and me and under the stars you pack up your car because you're going far away from here mm -hmm. i wish i could stall but i never getting really hot so I put my hair up and I'm realizing that I own less room things than I thought I did. We don't have any throw pillows because we threw out all of mine when I moved out of college because I'd had them for like five years and they were just getting really gross. Yeah so that's where we're at right now. So I'm definitely gonna have to make a home goods run of this video. I don't know if it's gonna be today or tomorrow but I think we need to move on from the bed so that's like low-key kind of a fail but don't worry we have a lot of other things to get done. Since we can't go with my plan of making the bed, I think I'm gonna build the nightstand because, you know, that's, that's part of the bed area anyway. And you might be wondering, like, where is the nightstand? Also, Bella, like, do you even have any furniture? And no, I do not own any furniture. But don't worry, because the last, like, three months, I've been scouring the internet, finding cute furniture that would be in my dream room, and I'm so excited. The funny thing about this is that I was like spending all this money traveling somewhere and I was like, I don't know how I'm gonna afford furniture for my room. Like genuinely, I did not know. I was like, I'll just sleep on the floor. Like, it'll be fine. You guys follow me on Instagram or TikTok, you know this already, but literally when I was going to fly into London this summer, I got bumped from my flight and they gave me like a ridiculous amount of money because I couldn't get on the plane and I used that to buy all this furniture. So thank you Delta Airlines 
for sponsoring this video. I'm just kidding, they're not actually sponsoring, but I could not have gotten all this furniture without that. So thank you, universe. Love you. Let me just show you guys um, all the boxes that we have. So that's all the boxes of furniture that we have presently, which is, I think it's a lot. I think for like my vision, I want to move this bookcase into this corner and have this corner over here be like the reading corner, the chair and the little stool. And then I think I want to put the nightstand on this side of the bed. Take a look out the window. Spirit goes up as the rain falls down. I've been sitting on the wrong course Keeping it together like I did before Think that I've said this a few times Even with that, has it ever felt right? I swear that this has happened every moment Can I just be honest? I was only wondering And maybe we could take it to a different conversation Things will get uncomfortable but only I made my nightstand it's so cute I love it I've been wanting like an acrylic piece of furniture for so long and I really really like it and it's perfect because it has a little shelf okay this is what I'm thinking for this little area which is gonna be the reading nook kind of situation I'm not sure if I like the arrangement of these three things but we can always move it around I'm just gonna try it out for right now I think I do like having the bookcase in the corner though because otherwise I feel like it's a little bit too random you know but I have to show you guys this chair and this poof that I got I'm so obsessed I think they're so perfect so this is the chair that I got I've been wanting it for so long I found both of these things at Target and this was like such a good deal on this chair also Vinny oh you want to go outside Okay, come on. Go inside. I just love that it's so low to the ground. It's so cozy and it does swivel and it's just so comfy and I love the design. So I thought I should get a little poof foot rest situation. So I got this one. It's kind of like a similar Sherpa material also from Target and it's basically just like a bean bag. So it's like comfy spot for your feet. And yeah, I'm thinking of putting obviously like books on there and then maybe taking this lamp that's my mom's and putting it right here and if I could show you I'd hope that you could see all the possibilities there could be a place before I fell asleep last night I made the decision that I should move the little reading corner to the window corner of the room and put the desk in that side and I cannot get it out of my head so I think we need to do it because we can always move it back but like the reason I originally wanted the desk over here is because I wanted like the natural light for like video calls and stuff I think it'll be fine over there but like it just feels like off to have it in that corner I don't know it's just like I felt like right before I fell asleep I was like I really really need to do that I'm gonna move this around and then I also really want to build the dresser today oh also this whole time I've been filming TikTok versions of this video like little mini installments of the room makeover so you should follow me on TikTok because I think it's gonna be really cute Okay, my camera died, and I know it doesn't seem like it's been a long time, but oh my god, I'm so tired <laughs> from building this freaking dresser. Like, I knew it would be the most complicated one to make, but I'm just very tired. It's taking so long. Literally, like, my hand from using the screwdriver, like, you can't tell, but in the middle, like, my skin is coming off because I've been, like, <laughs> twisting so many screws, but I'm almost done. I made, like, the base part, and I'm almost done with the drawers so let's finish it up
we did it we did it we made a dresser it is so adorable i'm like so tired and honestly a little bit sweaty from doing that but i took many tiktok breaks and it is beautiful i mean look at this look at this we made this with our own two hands honestly it's actually the perfect height i like it because it's taller than the bed which you can see it's obviously not very long this way so it's not like very wide i guess but i think it's a good size it's definitely adorable and i really like how it looks and none of the parts are broken or anything so i'm very proud of myself basically for like two years i've been wanting to have like a dresser because i haven't had one in a long time and it's super weird but i love that you have like the top of it to put little decorations and knickknacks on and that sounds so random but i feel like i really noticed that there weren't any surfaces i could display things on like in my dorm for example there's just the desk and that was it so i'm very excited to decorate the top of this and we're going to do like full decorating obviously but i've had this record player for maybe a year i think i got it last year for christmas or the year before i'm not sure but i love it and i wanted it for so long it's so cute but i haven't been able to use it at all because i couldn't transport it from connecticut to school because it was just too big to fit in any luggage so it's just been sitting in my parents closet and now i can finally use it and i'm too excited to not set it up so let's do it I feel Okay, I have had this light from Ikea for so long and I'm so excited to finally be able to like display it. It's so cute. I have this exact light pinned on like my dream room Pinterest board and I hunted down the exact light that I pinned and it's just, it's so satisfying. So it's like this like orb light and it looks so cool. I've already like plugged it in to make sure it works and everything. And then I got these smart Wi-Fi LED bulbs from Amazon. They look like change colors. You can make it any color you want, which is really fun. They are like Wi-Fi capable, so they connect to your phone and that's how you change the colors. But I did have a bit of an issue like setting them up initially, but now I think it works fine. So just be aware of that. It's a little tricky to get them set up. So this is what it looks like. I was so excited when I found this exact lamp. oh my god okay this is literally like my dream nightstand look at this it's so adorable i just love this lamp i don't know i just think it's the cutest thing it literally looks like a like bubble a bubble gum right now and it's adorable i ordered these prints for above the bed and they are super super adorable i really like them i'll show you in a second but today i really want to like actually decorate because at this point we've actually done all of the furniture building which is kind of like the hardest part i think which is good but i think i'm gonna do a separate video on like the desk work area but that is a sneak peek that you get in back there i got these from amazon and i love oh, i'm so excited i love this color so much there are three like aura prints which i just i'm really into i have these like all over my pinterest first one and then they have angel numbers on them too and like a little like description of the angel number which is so cute so we got a pink one we have an orange and pink one a blue and pink one which is so cute before i hang up the posters i decided that i wanted to get all the decorations that i had in storage and put them all out on the bed and i'm so glad i did this because i feel like it was so helpful in seeing what i actually had and which little like decorations and things went together to really make sure that everything was like what i wanted it to look like and kind of like the vibe that i was going for so i just took out all my stuff from storage and put it out on the bed which was so so helpful and also if you guys are listening to this right now you should subscribe because like 93 percent of people who watch my videos are not subscribed and it would literally mean the entire world anyway back to decorating <laughs> Okay, I just put all of my decorations out on the bed because I wasn't really sure what I actually had and this is all still packed up from my dorm. So I had some stuff stored under my bed and in the closet and I just wanted to like put it all in one space so I could see what we were working with and I just... I love everything I have. Like I've been like, I just love collecting little things that I really 
like and just really bring me joy and I think are really pretty and just seeing them all together makes my heart so happy but anyway let me show you <laughs> this is the rather chaotic situation we got so I have obviously some pillows over there I have a bunch of candles a lot of posters and just some little knickknacks that are just you know basically just little decorations to make the room come together but I just love everything I feel like I know what I like so everything is like a similar color which makes decorating very easy which is nice but I don't know what I'm gonna do with some stuff like the disco ball I'm gonna have to think about that more and then the mirrors as well but I think I'm just gonna put the little doodad stuff on the bookshelf probably and just like decorate with those right now and then I can actually hang up the posters once I've really thought about where I want to put those. Okay, it is another room makeover day and today is Friday. I started this at like the beginning of the week and I've been having so much fun doing this but also part of me is like I just want to get this done so I can actually enjoy being in this room and do other things because my to-do list like besides doing the decorating is getting a little bit long um, and I would just really like to enjoy the space. So I really want to just like buckle down today and really try to put up as much stuff as I can. So enjoy some time lapses like a lot of time lapses but I think I'm gonna try and hang up some posters because honestly that's really like the big thing that I have to do because I am gonna be doing like the desk situation separately I think so let's freaking do it No one seems to hold me like you do You're so wonderful A star could never shine as bright as you Even the dark they still see light Even the birds still sing at night Every word just comes out right When I'm with you, with you I feel so lucky I met you and I still um, can't believe that I get to see those eyes from more than tonight. I swear you must have fell from the sky and I feel um, so lucky I met you. It's not bad to come. 